Hello and welcome to Dream Station. So let's show you guys the pet skills. Okay, so I have them translated right here. Okay, where is it? Uh, okay, there we go. All right. Now let's show you in the journal. Let's take a look at the pets. There we go. So here we've got pouring on the first of our pets. The first attack that you can see here, um, uh, okay, that's pointed. It's it's better. So the first attack we got here, it does a 200% physical damage. Let's move to the next skill. The next skill is environmental protection. This skill will increase your drop rate of cone items in 1% per level. So if it's level 10, it's going to be 10 extra percent drop hate let's move to next one so this skill is heat up and as it says it sucks it increased 10 points of heat at level 10 next skill all right the last skill will increase the pet ATP and 20 per level so 20 HP per level uh, it also sucks, but it's okay for a free pet, I guess. Let's switch to the next pet, which is Yo-Yo. Yo. So Yo-Yo will do on first kill 200% damage, of uh, physical damage. On the second skill, he will do the Passionate. That's the best skill ever! For leveling up so you must have the yo-yo with you because at level 10 it will increase 10% of base experience so let's move to the next pet oops next skill forgive me so the next skill is attack speed up it will increase your speed or attack speed or whatever you want to call it in zero <coughs> And oh, that five percent. So that skill will add at level ten five percent extra attack speed. So let's move to the last skill, which has the concentration icon. It should make new icons so people don't get confused. But however, they didn't. So the last skill is called Bullet Time. The Bullet Time will increase the protection against critical attacks in one point so that one is bad the last point yes but okay so let's move through the next pet with the mandragon the mandragon seed first attack is magic sound surgery it does a 220 percent of magic damage it's not magic pressure it is magic sound surgery okay so that's at level one in uh, each level we increase plus 220 so yeah anyways so uh, curios curios is the the next skill this will increase the drop of precious materials like sand steel and those other ones like iron and stuff you know those that is a bit higher uh, value in the action so the next skill is that's a very good one for farming though the next skill does um preach hate up that's very very interesting because this skill will increase the critical hate in one percent per level so at level 10 you get 10 percent extra critical damage that's a lot so it's one of the best pets for mini class all right um let's go for the next one with the baby desert wolf so the baby desert wolf oh, of course we forgot forgot one skill here uh, it's this one it's to increase magical defense and four per level so on desert wolf we got the crunch with a 220 attack um, physical attack let's go for the next one the next one is is a very good one too the stamina consuming will be 
less 1%. At level 10, less 10% of stamina usage. So that's a very good skill. So the next skill is... Oh, but the one detail is it's not implemented yet. So it doesn't matter if you get it or not because it won't work. Okay, so next skill is... Feral's attack. It, you will ignore defense and all that 5% per level, which is a 5% at level 10. And his last skill is Appetite Strong, which is this one. And it will increase the HP in 1% per level. So you get 10% extra HP, which is good for tankers and good for the Paladin tankers. So that's the patch you want to have. Okay, let's go for Isis now. Okay, Isis. The first skill is Heart of Charm, which also has a magic pressure. Oh no. It does 220 magical damage. The next one is with this one, which looks like uh, the Hast skill, or whatever. This one will increase the drop height of MVP and 1% per level. So it goes for 10% extra drops from MVP. So that's what a lot of people get in this particular pet. Okay, let's move to the next one. So next one is Angel Pet. It will increase the healing received in 0.5%. Per level which means okay 5% and you should know this at this moment all right let's go for next skill and the last one is savage no no that's the next pet uh, that was the last skill it will increase oh, of course I forgot one this one in this one we increase the healing and this one we will reduce the cast by 0.5% per level with 5% reduction of cast at level 10. Alright, moving to the next pet, which is Savage. Savage will do 200 physical damage on this first skill. On the second skill, we will reduce the time um, that takes to make the quest in the book when you use a savage so you have 10% reduction at level 10 of the time required to complete it so next one is plus 1 plus 10 at level you know level 10 plus 10 true damage that skill sucks it will add literally 10 damage points that ignore defense okay so next skill is defense 4 Defense for each level would go for 14 defense at level 10. That's a kind of good skill uh, for defense. There's the other one that increases HP. This one is the second good option for tankers. Now, the next pet is. Okay, there we go. So, he. So, her first skill. No, it's. Yes, yes, yes. It's code boat. For the first time, it is code boat. There is the kanji for Cody, but not. It's not read the, like that in in Chinese. However, it's Cody in in Japanese. But whatever. So the code boat uh, is three hundred percent magical damage. So so he is the most powerful pet for farming as it going to do the most powerful magical damage and following we have pure which is using that uh, symbol again as it seems they are shortened on people to make <sighs> logos okay what this skill does is pretty awesome as well it will increase the drop rate of cards at level 10 by 10 percent so if you're looking to drop cards, that's the path you should have. However, 10% of a 0, 0, 1% uh, isn't much at all. However, it's better than nothing, you know? Okay, next skill is Medic Attack Up. So this is 